The combination of ipilimumab and nivolumab has really demonstrated significant promise. Phase one trial data from Mario Schnall most recently, originally published by Jed Walchok, showed that that combination has a very high response rate and now that we've followed patients long term for several years, we've seen really impressive long term survival from that group of patients that had received the combination of ipilimumab and nivolumab. And ba based upon the favorable results from that study, we've actually been testing that combination against each of the drugs, both ipilimumab by itself and nivolumab by itself, and we've seen that the combination is quite impressive in, in those contexts as well, in the randomized larger phase trials. The phase three data were presented by Dr. Walchok at ASCO in 2015 and had been subsequently published in New England Journal by James Larkin. Those data, importantly, that is the progression-free survival data and the response rate data. What we really are excited and waiting for is the overall survival data to see if patients that have gotten both drugs have overall survival improvements compared to either drug by themselves. And we need that information.